I am never doing this again. Hey vapors, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, hello, I'm Tia, and I hope you'll stick around. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy it, and don't forget to subscribe for more vape videos. Turn on the bell notification symbol so you don't miss a single upload. You can check the description box below for important links, like where to find me outside of YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, or Twitter. I use Twitter to chat with you guys every day, and I love Instagram to post my daily life on my Instagram story. I'm addicted to it. I also do all of my extra vape stuff giveaways over there on my social medias because they are not allowed to be done on YouTube. I'm not risking it. Sorry. So just check Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. I might have an open giveaway right now. I might not. I do one like several times a month. I do giveaways. So I also have a Patreon account where I do monthly vape related rewards. I am adding a mod and e-liquid tier to that this month. So it'll be available for May. And I also have a second YouTube channel where I do um, vlogs like of my life and like just other hobbies and interests and like baby related stuff because I do have a nine month old son. So if you want to see like more of a personal life versus like this is just my vape hobby channel and check out my second channel all those links will be below but let's get right into it i'm actually really excited to try today's product we have the how to mod this is a combination of artery and uh tony b who also does vape reviews here on YouTube. And I'm super excited because I love pod devices. And this kind of reminds me of like the Anybox or the Cup D like feel. I just, I'm so excited. So I have the purple one here. And this was actually sent to me by directvapor.com. So you can check out their website if you wanna um, get this or check all the other colors or anything that it has. And I also have um, coils. I also have a pod cartridge this holds three mils so it does have these pod cartridges and then it also has 0.6 ohm mesh coils good between 15 and 23 watts but can we just like oh look at that color i'm excited so that is the mod but i'm gonna also go underneath that layer to see what it all comes with we do have the user's manual right on top here the certificate of quality control right here warranty card micro usb to usb cord used for charging and two teeny tiny little coils so let's take a closer look at these coils real quick real quick so this first one is the 0.6 ohm mesh coils good between 15 and 23 watts this is different that's actually a 1.2 ohm good between 7 and 12 watts so this is um like a direct to lung vape and then the the 0.6 ohm is the mouth to lung mesh i oh my god i love tony b he's such a nice guy from what i've experienced with him and so i'm really hoping that this vapes well because this is my size like this is my personal like preference of a vape i love small vapes and the button so here's a fire button and we have where the cartridge would go and the a micro usb charge port here let me let me get you a good look at that look at that very nice i do like it pal to the back the bottom and the top so let me check out this pod because it didn't come with a pod in the box so i'm only going to assume that whenever you order it it comes with a pod like it, it should i really really hope it does so what do we have here how many pods do we have one in here okay yes we just have one okay so it all makes sense now sorry i just get a little excited and i jump the gun sometimes so it does have the pod and you can change out the coils within the pod instead of changing the entire pod system, which that is definitely um, less waste um, for these pod system mods. Cause a lot of pod mods, you just change out the entire cartridge. Um, so you're throwing away a lot of plastic, but this you just change out the coil. So there isn't a coil installed, but it did come with two. And then this, okay, I'll let you see. I'm, I'm just excited. I really, really want to try it. So here you go this is the pod so you would just move that to fill it and then you can fill it and you want to have the coil in there before you fill it and to change the coil you just spin this little base off so it comes out like that and then you put the coil in so i'm going to go ahead and put the coil in and for the sake of this video i am going to do the 0.6 ohm mesh because that is definitely more my style so i'm just gonna 
put it in there like that, I guess, and um, screw the base back on. I, I'm assuming this is how you do it. Or do you put it in the base and then put the base and the coil in there? I'm not sure. We will find out. If it doesn't vape, then I did it wrong. If it does vape, then we did good. And another thing that I really want to point out that is awesome is this base has adjustable airflow. Your girl is shook. Oh my god. That's awesome. Okay, we're gonna leave it wide open for the sake of this video because that is um, how I like to vape. And because I don't vape anything else, that's a lie. I vape other things, but like 90% of the time I don't mean to be like narcissistic or I don't know, but I vape my own flavor, which is Cloud Kiss. It is a strawberry cake batter flavor available at bonsaivapor.com and you can use my code TIA20 for 20% off your order of this 100 ml bottle available in 0, 3, and 6, and 12 milligrams or you can use the code TIA20 to get 20% um, off anything, any of the flavors that they offer there. So I'm going to go ahead and fill this up and then I will come back and vape it for you. So I just, I'm failing and it's, it's becoming a little bit messy for me because I'm just too excited and I'm rushing myself and I need to slow down and fill this thing up nicely. Give it, at least get the e-liquid above the juice flow holes. All right, we have it. Oh, I'm so excited to vape this. I hope it does amazing. For a second, I was like, what's going on? This back panel is completely removable. It is connected but with two magnets, but then you can see where the cartridge fits. So you want to push it down into there. Okay, so this is kind of giving me, this is actually kind of giving me, um, what's that? What is that, that vape that um, Kanger Tech came out with? I can't remember what it was called. Yeah, I don't know what it's called, but I have, I have, a, I have a video for it, but oh well. Um, it reminds me of that vape. Wow, wow, what was that called? I'll put it on the screen so you guys know what I'm talking about. But, okay, so it's all set up. Now I'm gonna let the coil wick up really good and tell you more about the, oh my God, if this vape's great, then I am sold because this is like beautiful color, handheld for me. Oh my God, it, it can't get any better. So this little guy is 83 millimeters by 43 millimeters by 17 millimeters. There is a 1000 milliamp hour built in rechargeable battery in this little guy. This is a three mil pod, but they do have a two mil pod option to be TPD compliant for our EU vapors. And right there next to the charge board, there is a little indicator light. So it is blue, purple, and red color for the battery indicator. When it lights up blue, it's anywhere from 50 to 100%. When it lights up purple it's 15 to 50 percent and then when it's red it's 15 or lower so you need to charge it to turn it on you push the fire button five times and then that will fly up three times blue and if you push it five more times it'll flash blue again three times and that's turning it off and it does have protection features so like short circuit and things like that um, which I always find is a plus and something else I wanted to point out is you don't even have to take out the pod to fill it You can just remove this back panel and uh, fill through the fill plug. So That's that too. Oh my god. I'm so excited. So it's on I'm Just gonna do priming puffs So I'm like inhaling without pushing the fire button in hopes that it'll suck some juice into the coils it looks like it has like a lanyard option right here anybody else like think that that's like or is it just it's actually just probably airflow but like you could like technically stick a lanyard in there i think <laughs> and it's for it's for airflow i see the airflow base in there duh tia but you could totally put a lanyard in there if you wanted to okay should we try it out guys You guys, I love it. I love it. The flavor, 
so good. But, like mesh coils are awesome. Flavor is so good. The airflow, I could, I think I could even turn this down and still enjoy it, but the airflow is, I love the airflow option. That is fantastic. The vape is good. The cloud production is awesome. Tony B, good job. Artery, great job. I, I've looked at artery stuff before. What else have they made? I'm trying to blank on all these older mods that I've looked at, but oh my God, I love this guy. That was a long drag. I love it. It's kind of, I think I need to um, change my lighting a little bit. It's kind of dark right now because the light's like behind me. I'm usually sitting over there on that little futon, but you guys, da 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 da. This, this, oh my God, this, I mean, this is probably gonna replace my my current pod favorites, which I don't want to admit, but they're smock. <laughs> I love the Miko, but this, bitch. It's so much more prettier and like, just this color is beautiful to me. Oh, some pods you can vape without pushing the button, some you can do either or, and some you have to push the button. This is definitely one where you have to push a button. I love it, I love it. And let me just tell you, I'm not saying I love it just because another vape reviewer made it. I honestly think this might be the first, might be, don't quote me, because it could be wrong, but like this might be the first hardware that I've looked at that is um, in collaboration with another vape person. But I'm not sure. I know I've looked at other people's e-liquids. Like a long time ago, I looked at Suck My Mod's e-liquids. A long time ago, I looked at Grim Green's e-liquids. Who else? Anyways, I've, I've done it. Like other people's stuff. But like, I'm to the point in my YouTube channel with vaping that if I don't like something, I'm going to tell you guys because I'm done being like, oh, scared to, scared to give a negative review because I don't want the backlash. I'm not saying this is good just because Tony B did it. Like, even if Tony B's name wasn't on this, like, are you surprised that I love this? This is just the way I like to vape. This is my vape. This is like my vape style. Like, if if this was a huge, I don't have anything I can grab right now, but if this was like a huge mod and a huge tank and it was Tony B's, I'd be like, this is good if it was good, but I'm like obsessed with this. I wouldn't be in, like in love with it like I am with this because this is how I like to vape. Yes, bitch. Oh my god. Pal 2 is my pal too. It's not corny. Okay, guys. Um, these little pod devices are so simple, so there's not much more to say about it. You've seen how it performs. It comes in like black, red, and I think blue. Let me see. Black, red, gunmetal, and purple. So I think I was sent the purple one. I love this color. It's beautiful. Love it. I think the only thing that could improve it because I'm spoiled now is the option to inhale without pushing the fire button. Cause I've gotten so used to using these pods that don't require a fire button to, to vape it that I, like I said, I'm spoiled now. So like I want both options, but like I still love it and I'm going to use it probably all of the time. It's probably gonna be like my go with me mod because I don't really vape at home just because I'm almost always around my son. So right now I'm in my office and I have the door closed um, and he's actually napping in our bedroom with the door closed but I don't vape around him at all. It's my personal choice and so I don't vape when I'm at home but I have like one or two vapes that are always in my purse and uh, this one is going in there and I'm taking the Nord out because that's the one that's just been in my purse for a long time. All right guys, that is awesome. My son is up. You probably can hear him crying. He just woke up. I literally was just like, he's napping. And now he's woke up and he didn't take a very long nap. I was hoping I could get through a couple videos. 
oh well i hope you enjoyed the video let me know down in the comments below what you think of the pal 2 i will tell you where to get it again that's directvapor.com d-i-r-e-c-t-v-a-p-o-r.com i love direct vapor they're my favorite place to shop online but that's it for the video i hope you enjoyed and give it a thumbs up if you did i will see you in the next video fight for your right to vape so as always i'm tian thank you so much for watching